Seattle police have made plenty of visits to this street. Nice to see you. And nice to see you Mark. too. Hi, Mark. But today is different. They stand beside volunteers <laughs> and students, all here for the same reason. It was a total community effort, which has been really amazing. Nice work. Oh. They're ready for a change of scenery. Hi. These property owners said, hey, let's put it on the outside of our fence. It's right on this intersection. Whoa. Guys, feel this. A canvas to start the conversation about what's been happening. Off and on, drug dealing and shots fired. I think that's why we decided to put it at this park where um, a lot of drive-bys happen and stuff. Khalib Tafera, a high school senior, okay. helped paint the mural. Part of a month-long student project. Did you drop that? And now it it's all hands on deck. Like two drops, and then I finally get it. Dropping them. To drill in the artwork. You're gonna try and get it right in the middle there. Okay, now scoot it towards me. Push it. To leave this stamp on the neighborhood. Perfect. Exactly. I'm actually kind of happy with this. And one of the ones that really struck me was hands, not guns. So there's different ways of expressing yourself than violence. You can express it like at a boxing ring. So that's one of the panels. That's what it resembles. There it goes. Nice. There's also nature, not narcotics. The sound of music instead of the sound of bullets. I hope they like it. You know, if they drive past, they see it. This meal is going up, dude. If I come down here, it's like, oh, I helped make that. You know, it's kind of cool. I love it. I think it's great. Voila, there you go. Woo. One, two, three, art. Not long after this proud moment, see neighbors start to notice. It's a, a nice, uh, nice addition in the neighborhood, definitely. It's good. The bright colors catch attention. I see two pairs of gloves. In a place where violence has torn families apart. I'd like to put one on my retaining wall in front of my house. Well, there you go. That's the next project. All right. Some see a painting with the potential to bring people together. In Seattle, Natalie Swaby, King 5 News.